Hi, welcome back to a new tutorial uh, from Blender. Today we'll make a tree in five minutes or so, uh, a fast tree. So, uh, Blender has an add-on for building trees. That is here in user preferences. And there you can go add add-ons and there enable. Uh, on your side is not enable, uh, but I show you um, how it's called. Add sapling tree gen. That is for generating trees. You can search here uh, and activate them. Yeah. Sapling tree gen. Okay. Uh, now we go back and we start the tool. The tool we find under add curve sapling tree gen generator then we have here um picture some uh, values of this um, add-on you see here on the tree that it builds when you click bevel you see it will be solid take here a little bit of them here you can say how is the shape of the tree ten no, or cylindric or something else yeah you can play around with that but we want to make it fast uh, so we let that I'll make the scale a little bit higher okay wonderful then here you can we have now added the gen geometry uh, now we go to the branch splitting how much branches on the branches so we give here and um, two, uh, three, sorry. Uh, and here we go back. Yeah. And now you see it's well good for now. You can split the high. or oh, yeah. You can play around with that. It's no problem. Um, but that is enough for this um, tutorial. So we go here to the leaves. And say we want show leaves. Uh huh. We see them, okay. And now we want to make them a little bit uh, greater. So here's the scale. We give them a good size for leaves, okay. So we have that. That's enough for the moment. So we click on the leaves and open up uh, a new image editor and go here to the edit mode and now you see one leaf and the one leaf is like all other will look so what we make we give them a material and to this material we say we want to have an image of a leaf so open an image from a leaf I have some here and uh, I take this one, uh, the images from um, textures.com. There you can download that. So then we open here that leaf that we have here. And now you see we have this leaf on this object. So um, this is an alpha texture that we have, uh, so we must um, give the material an alpha channel. So we do that and we make here a node editor. And now we must say the black should be transparent for alpha channel. So what we need? We need, we have the picture, it is diffuse material and here's the output in the surface. So we need a mixer, add shader, mixer, and clap them in two. Then we take another shader, it's called transparent. We make the transparent to this, it's important, and the diffuse to that. Then we use the alpha channel as a factor. 
now you see it's white in the in the background but it's not real when you look random mode you see there it is very good you have on the on our tree next step is to make the the, the press uh, the base in the color. so we click the base and uh, we look there and it is a curve so we must convert them as a mesh we make it with um, alt and c convert curve uh, mesh from curve so now we have a normally mesh there and we give them a material this material should uh, light the bark so we take image texture and give them a bark uh, I have some bark here that is a bark wonderful we take them now you see oh very wired so what we make the unwrap is the problem so we must unwrap these others so we mark them and make it with smart UV projection unwrap it takes a while but then you will see um, the texture is um, other uh, to uh, to this uh, bark um, so we need uh, to get here the UV coordinates that we build it there so we take input texture coordinates and we need a mapping to control where it is there's a mapping UV we connect with the vector and the vector with the picture so we have that we look to our branch and render them again you see a little bit better but um it is too small so um we must change the mapping the mapping means you can say how great should the texture be where it should be and which rotation it should have so we give here 10 so we say the texture is smaller and now you see we have a texture on our tree wonderful and when we make here some light in we give the sun uh, hard factor we look in our render you see we have a wonderful tree I can give them here in the background so you see better what our tree uh, has a good uh, looking yeah we take some here that is good so now you see there's one tree five minutes work you have a wonderful result thanks a lot see you in the next